Well, it's official. Instagram theme pages are on their way out. And here's what Instagram's Adam Mozeri had to say about it this week. If you create something from scratch, you should get more credit than if you are resharing something that you found from someone else. We're gonna do more to try and value original content more, particularly compared to reposted content. So more to come there as well. Again, creators are incredibly important to the future of Instagram and we wanna make sure that they are successful on the platform and that they're getting all the credit that they deserve. So let's take a second to talk about both the pros and the cons that are gonna come with this decision because whether you agree or disagree with it, there are both good things and bad things that are gonna come from this. Now, the first con obviously is that this is gonna suck for any theme pages out there, right? And you guys know me, you know my story. Over the past year and a half, I blew up my page to over 33,000 followers, really just running it like a theme page. But for me, this is an area where I was beginning to try and pivot anyways. You guys, if you've watched my videos, know that I've been talking for the last couple of months about transactional versus relational marketing and pivoting into making your own content once you get that core fan base. But that's just the thing is, I would always preach or tell people that you should get you should get that core fan base off of reposting content. And where Instagram is really nerfing reposting content, that kind of sucks for the new guys that are trying to get started because I was saying, hey guys, look, this is an exploit. This is an area where you can grow your page really fast, get a bunch of people that are interested in your topic to your page, and then convert them over into following you for your content. I mean, really, I think this, I think this hurts the new guy that was using this as a sort of growth strategy to get started, to get a few thousand followers before they really started applying their own time, money, and effort into growing their Instagram account. That's just the thing, man, is making your own content is dope, it's fun, but it's very time consuming and it's hard to kind of justify that if you only have 10 followers and you're not growing very fast. And realistically, one of the cons that I see coming from this is I do think that original content will get a little bit more of a push, but I don't think that it'll be proportionate to the amount of push that you could get from being a page that reposts because really there wasn't that many reposting pages out there as there are original creators out there. And then one other potential con that I see that maybe I'm a little bit skeptical or curious about is what's gonna happen to news pages. When you really think about it, the entire job of the news media is to repost content, whether that's Fox News, CNN, or a page like DJ Academics that reposts what's going on on a rapper's story or on a rapper's Instagram page, right? Is that's the function of the news media. Are news pages gonna be negatively impact or how advanced is the AI gonna be? If I just slap some new text on an image or I just slap a new label on it, is it now not gonna see it as me reposting content and now sees it as unique content? That's something that I'm gonna be curious to see because that could be a big con for news pages, man. But that's enough of the negative, man. I wanna talk a little bit about the positive and some of the good things that I see coming from this. Now, first of all, I think that this is gonna be good for Instagram as a platform. And one of the biggest critiques about Instagram over the years has been, yo, Instagram does no innovation. When you look at Instagram, they're always lagging behind platforms like TikTok, YouTube, you name it, because they're scared to make any changes. They're not innovating or thinking outside the box. I think that this change or this innovation is a little bit forward thinking. And I think that this could be good for the health of the platform over time, which in turn would be good for us creators on the platform. Because let's face it, one of the worst things that could happen is all this time that we spend on Instagram learning the platform, growing our pages on the platform. If Instagram dies, if people stop going to Instagram and it shrinks and it's gone, almost like a MySpace, then all this work we just did is out the window. So at the end of the day, Instagram has to think about Instagram survival first. And that really is one of the most important things for us as creators on the platform. I also think that this is gonna be better for people to potentially make money off of Instagram. We've talked about it on my channel before. I said it earlier. There's a big difference in transactional versus relational marketing. And when you're posting your own content, you're being yourself on social media, you're gonna build way better, way deeper relationships with your audience. And that's gonna allow a lot more people to maybe make money or to have real impact on the platform as opposed to if they were just running reposting pages and never taking the time to make their own content. So I think that we could see deeper relationships between creators and customers or users of the platform. But these are just my first thoughts and hearing that news and watching that video. I do think that things will change, but honestly speaking, I don't think that this change is gonna be as big as people are calling it or as big as people think. I think reposting will probably get nerfed, but I think that it'll still probably be an okay strategy for growing a page. I don't think that it'll be what it once was, but I don't think that it'll be completely gone. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. My name is Mitchell and I appreciate you guys for stopping in. If you guys like this video, if you guys wanna grow an Instagram account with me, you guys want my help, just comment below, hit subscribe. I am down to help out anybody who needs it. 
I love you guys. And as always, God bless and have a good one, man.